What led you to the swimming hall? Oh, Will said there was something important in his briefcase. All I found was a key with Bradbury swimming hall on the chain. Only lead we had. I guess this is it. This building's been shut down for years. Perfect place to hide something you don't want found. I think it's time you tell me what you know. I know your brother built the one thing that can stop the fracture. I know we're meant to find it, and I know Mater doesn't want us to. And yet you're wearing their uniform. I like the way their pants fit. Yeah, I bet you like the paycheck too. Try to create a cover to gather information. You've known about this for a few hours. I've been preparing for it for most of my life. You weren't aware that William owned the place? There's a lot I didn't know about Will. We need to find your brother's countermeasure. And fast. Things will get worse as the fracture progresses. And Monarch will be turning Riverport over looking for you. <laughs> Will's key. Maybe it unlocks this. The key doesn't fit. Okay. I'm gonna find another way in. Make it quick. I'll keep a lookout for unwanted company. Hey, I think I found a way in. All right. Yes, Amy? What is it? There were others taken from the university. Friends of mine. What happened to you? Stutters aren't going away. <laughs> Will had used the building to hide away his personal items. What the hell were you doing here, brother? Time travel experiments with rats? Okay, May 17th, 1998. This is William Joyce, and I'm about to conduct the first animal test. You owned this place since prototype. 1999? Why didn't you tell me, Will? He's gone. No wonder you are always coming up with crazy come shit. Come on, come on, come on. You're okay. You're all right. You're all right. You're all right. Okay, finally, we're sending Schrodinger into the machine. Hello, Riverport. Teresa Sedmak here, filling in for Bobby Rathford. About to brighten your day with some good news. In there? Working on it. All right, let's take a look around. Down here. <sighs> nice work. This note. It's directed at me. July 4th, 2010. Well. Beth Wilder, I'm addressing this video to you. You told me to stay away from my workshop, but I couldn't just leave it there. I went back to get it, and the entire place is a disaster zone. The countermeasure, gone, taken. Shit. What the? Safe, empty. I just need to know you have it. Because if it falls into the wrong hands, its power is immeasurable. Our future, our entire lives.
lives depend on it. This can't all be for nothing. You know where to find me. Please, hurry. 2010. Holy shit. 2010. What was that? Wilder, I'm addressing this you video recorded here. that for me in 2010? He said the countermeasure's well, gone? It's a disaster zone. The countermeasure's not good. Gone. We need care. to figure this out. Shut down. Let's keep looking. Safe, empty. I just need to know you have it. Because if it falls into the wrong hands, its power is immeasurable. Our future. Help me push this out of the way. Depend on it. This can't all be for nothing. <clears throat> Find me. Please. Jack. Hurry. Your brother addressed that video to me. <clears throat> but I've never met him before in my life. Well, it sounded like he thought you had his countermeasure. I wish. But he said it was stolen on July 4th, 2010. Somebody took it. <clears throat> but I'm hoping this place will help us figure out who. I'll give you the honor of pressing the button. Is that? Yeah, I think so. A second time machine. This changes everything. If we can get this thing working, then we don't need that countermeasure. We can change everything. What if we stop the fracture from ever happening in the first place? We can go back to yesterday. It says the time machine core needs to be reset. Great. A round thing in the middle, think. No, nothing I can make sense of. Hey, it looks like I can reset the core from here. You sure you know what you're doing there? No clue. But I, I did help Paul set up the machine at the university. Which then caused the fracture. Look, Will knew the calculations were wrong. I'm hoping that means he knew what he was doing here. This is what Will leads to. We have to test it. The core. That's what we set up first. could actually be the key to finding the countermeasure. We'll see. It's still resetting. The core is reset. We need to activate it from the control room. The controls are up here, according to the monitor. This is gonna work. It has to. Here goes nothing.
was that? It's fine. It's fine. It worked. <laughs> it actually worked. Okay. We activate the corridor next. Okay, there's no way that thing should be exposed like that. These schematics are all in Will's writing. He did all of this. Built everything. The corridor. It's key activated. Will's key. Thank God. Um, is that supposed to do that? Will's key did that? Yeah. To a time machine, and he left it in the trunk of his goddamn car. <laughs> That's my brother Natch. That didn't sound good. Oh, fuck. Let's just hope it still works. you are you saw what happened something's wrong with the machine we don't know that you're not trained for this anything you do is gonna make it worse we you can't know i'm right stop trying you lost people you're angry i get it but this is bigger than us we can't fix the machine but i might know somebody who can sophia amaral Monarch scientist. I saw her video near Ground Zero. Serene's had a chronic research. She'll be at the Monarch Gala tonight, but security's airtight. She'll be nearly impossible to get to. Unless I have an invite. Paul told me he expected me to meet him at that party. Something tells me that was not a friendly invitation. Jack, no. 